The International Day of Solidarity with the Palestinian People was designated by the United Nations on November 29, in 1977. The day is marked every year internationally, with rallies and activities aimed to drawing attention to the struggle of the Palestinian people. This year, a protest was held in the village of Khan al-Ahmar that is under a threat again to be demolished by the Israeli military. On this day, Palestinians assured they will continue to defend their lands amid calls by the Palestine Liberation Organization to enable the Palestinians to exercise their right to self-determination and their independent state. We are still struggling to protect our basic rights against Israeli regime violence. Meanwhile, our dream of an independent Palestinian state has not yet come true. We have come here to voice our protest against Israel's aggression. We are the real owners of these lands. This year, however, Palestinians say they were left alone struggling the Israeli occupation and its non-stop attempts to annex more lands, mainly after some Arab states have signed normalization deals with Tel Aviv. These ties, Palestinians say, simply undermine efforts for Palestinian state. Palestinian officials stress that what they see as a symbolic international solidarity has failed to give the Palestinian people their rights, while Israel continues to occupy most of the land of historical Palestine. Israel will not be deterred by statements of condemnation. Israel can be, uh, can be stopped only by popular nonviolent Palestinian struggle and boycott divestment sanctions against its system of apartheid. That's what we want to see, BDS, not normalization with occupation. The UN, meanwhile, has renewed commitment to the Palestinian people. However, its Secretary General, Antonio Guterres, has cautioned that the prospects for a viable two-state solution are becoming more distant, mainly with Israel's expansion of illegal settlements, a significant spike in the demolition of Palestinian homes and structures, violence, and continued militant activity. After more than 40 years since the International Day of Solidarity with the Palestinian people was designated by the UN, Palestinian rights remain usurped and the dream of an independent Palestinian state has not yet come true. Mona Qandil for Press TV, Occupied Ramallah.